Man, what's up with y'all? Hey, do me a favor. Smash that like button for me, right? So we're going to talk a little bit more to Fima Lopez. You dig? So, T.O., where the Brian Custer interview at, Ron? Huh? That's what we want to know. You dig? See, you hiding over there behind Punch Drunk Boxing. Okay? It's because, you know, just from me being able to read things for the way they are, right? You ain't slick. I'm going to tell you why. It's because you know in your heart and your mind that you about to lose. So you pampering to your people, your, your, your people, what you say, right? You pampering to them because you know it's going to get bad, son. When you lose, right? All the black fighters going to be heckling you. All the Scottish people are going to be heckling you. All your, 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 your New Yorkers going to be heckling you, right? Because you lost to a man from overseas. Twice, two, two, two different. Sam Lamar, we count him too. You hear me? So, now three. Uh, uh, George Cambosos and all of them white. But you got problems with the brothers, right? So you go run behind Punch Drunk Boxing and that platform over there. Well, you do what you do, you hear me? That, that's neither here nor there. But what I'm saying is, son, so, so, so why you can't go sit down with Brian Custer, right? It's either two things that didn't happen with that. Number one, Brian Custer already recorded that interview. And it was so bizarre, he just looked at it and was like, uh-uh. Like, nah, I'm not even going to tarnish my platform with this foolishness. Like, you know, if I was Custer, if I, I, I'll release it, bro. And I'll just show my facial expressions the whole time. You feel me? I'll just, you know, just so people can see how stupid he is. Right, because he, he's clearly stupid. I proved that from how many different angles? How much more do y'all need me to prove how stupid Tia Fima Lopez is, right? I used to rock with Tio, man, huh? until he started talking that racist nonsense. And it's not just that, but he kept, he kept picking at it. Just picking at it, picking at it, picking at it with dirty fingers, right? Just don't even care. And then say, I'm not apologizing for it. Yeah, so, man, you know what, bro? So, I'm going to tell you what I want to see. I want to see Josh Taylor stop you. You heard me? No, you know what? In fact, I want to see your pop store that, that, that white towel in the ring. You heard me? That's what I want to see, don't. You said, quote unquote, that you is ready for the morgue. That's what you said it came out your mouth. When Reed just woo guru said he's going to put you in a hospital. Right? Say, um, Tia Fima Lopez said he's going he gonna to eat this year. Right? Okay, well, he, he'll put you in a hospital. And, and, and we already see uh, uh, how you responded to that. You said that, okay, you want to put me in a... I'm ready for that more. That's what you said, right? So I want to see you get stopped. I don't want to see you get stopped worse than the Canelo Alvarez, don't you? feel me? In fact, bro, it, it, it's either I want to see your pops. I'm visualizing this, bro. I'll I be holding my fingers together like this. But I'll be in this, this high connex box. Be medit be lev levitating, meditating in here to see to see that white <laughs> to see that white towel get thrown in the ring from your pops. You hear me? Let your pops save you and clean up that clean up that bloody mess in the ring with that white towel, like your bomb blood sport. You hear me? Scooping up the little, the little toothpaste. Yeah, that's why I want it. <laughs> so let me stop.